What's up guys, my name is Potato and welcome to uh, well the first server Saturday-ish type of video that I've put out in a couple of weeks and that's because Mongoose Country has been through some troubled, troubled times and um, it's unfortunate but we're finally on the right track of uh, making things all better now and as you guys uh, probably already can see this is our Season 7 map which uh, is still going to be around for about another month or so but uh, due to some very good news. Um, good buddy of mine, Candle, actually just finished building the new Season 8 spawn, which uh, for all current Mongoose Country members is currently open. Uh, maybe I should disconnect multiplayer. There we go. Season 8. Here we go. It's nighttime. Let me do a quick time day. So this is spawn right here. You should hopefully spawn on this pad and you don't fall off into the water or whatever. But um, it is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen ever and um, Candle did just such an amazing job at this my speed is still too too fast there we go and um, he wanted to go with a sort of a cylinder type of thing a tower if you will which is uh, definitely seems like his MO but god damn does he pull it off uh, it is honestly just one of the most beautiful things that I've seen and he did all of this in under a week he was he had a lot more time he I gave him about a month and a half but uh, because of complications with an old host we lost it and then it really just threw our groove off and uh, everything just went downhill from there but we uh, we pulled our pants back up and got back to to working on this thing so he finished this about two days ago and um, since then we went into configuring all of the NPCs and stuff like that so I'm gonna take you guys through a quick tour of the new map because uh, new members and uh, even newer members if you guys apply because applications will be opening not today but probably tomorrow maybe tonight I don't know it depends on my schedule today but all of the NPCs that you guys know and loved are down here below now all of the uh, the donation NPCs are right here still work exactly the same way as they used to they do have different colored names but that's fine Nothing, uh, nothing different there. These are the traders right here. Builder, where you can buy different sorts of, of blocks or sell different sorts of blocks to buy different sorts of blocks. We have the gardener, a bunch of other things. You can thank Paradoxian for staying up in crazy. Not, not I was going to say incredible, but then I said crazy. It's in crazy. It's both words mi mixed together. In crazyable amount of time uh, recoding these because with every fucking update of Citizens, it seems like we need to recode these things. And you can see Seth Bling is over here hanging out with us. He's going to be our redstone vendor. So if you go up to Seth Bling, talk to him. He'll try to sell you some crazy magical shit. And um, as you work around, <laughs> apparently we have a pig behind the counter. <laughs> the pig is the transport. He's just going to hang out here. And so if you guys want to buy a carrot on a stick, you come over here and pay, what is that, two million? That seems about right. That's I think that's about what it costs is about two million for a carrot on a stick because it's super rare and um, only a few few people on the server are gonna get carrot on a stick. You can see all of the the records and everything like that. Is that that's Junker Bill, right? And uh, we have Alfonso and the blacksmith over here. Alfonso still needs a little bit of work. I don't think he can actually sell things to him yet. Uh, the blacksmith is up and running. Just bring him your tools, whatever. And uh, the rest of the group is still here. So, uh, come on down here to the first level to uh, to buy and uh, and sell stuff, to trade in tokens, do etc. etc. We're gonna go down lower, to show you guys well, what's down below, and bam, this is where the spawns farm is right here. So you got some trees over there, you got uh, your pumpkins, got wheat, got sugar canes over there and over here, some melons, more wheat etc etc and I believe right here is the uh, the drop pit to jail which um, am I vanished right now Whoop. just both vanish without a G maybe right there and jail is down there um, that still needs to be set up as well I forgot actually to set that up but that's fine but you gotta you gotta give props to candle if you guys haven't yet uh, you really should go check out uh, candles channel he um, he <laughs> During all of this, he still had time this week to uh, to put out a time lapse of his current mega build that he's working on, which is phenomenal. And he really doesn't get enough credit for what all the work that he puts in 
So guys, please go check out his channel, check out his stuff. He's a very talented builder and um, very dedicated, I'll tell you that much. Uh, so we got the nether right here. The nether is actually on a very short world border. It's uh, super small, I think it's only 100 by 100 blocks because uh, we're waiting for 1.5 to come out and we're gonna have to get rid of the nether anyways. So um, we're keeping it super tiny because of that. Uh, we have a warp wall over there for major builds. Uh, right now, the only thing on here is spawn. We got the uh, the end already ready for you guys to go here. For veterans of Mongoose Country, you know that we have a Ender Dragon instance that spawns three Ender Dragons, and um, that spawn is actually going to be way up there. And um, we'll have warp set to everything like that. But I do suggest that the first time that you guys go through spawn, just just walk around. It's it's fucking awesome. There's there's just there's so many things about this. Like the next level here is a library, which is three fucking floors. It's it's incredible. Uh, and uh, I believe the next one, yeah, right here. The dragon's instance is down because uh, we had an end portal thing here, but there, we couldn't figure out a way of shutting it off. Um, I'm pretty sure there's probably a separate plugin that we could run, but I don't want to run another plugin. So. Um, We'll have a multiverse uh, portal here at some point or another, but um, I highly doubt that any of you are going to be running in here and start killing three Ender Dragons at once, uh, day one. But uh, the rest of this place, I believe, is just an attic. I could be wrong. Uh, no, it's just uh, good views up here, so you can just pop on up here and, and check out the insane view of this place. Um, yeah, see the top is just a little bit of an attic. But, uh, good news for Nubtown, um, Candle did take it apart, um, I'm gonna fly through the tunnel here. These are the transfer chests for those of you who, uh, who had one. I transferred this today at noon, around noonish. so, um, if you guys had a chest done by that time, it'll be in there, so, uh, make sure to go check that out. I've already locked it for you, and, uh, if you can't open it, it's because you spelt your name wrong, uh, and, uh, it's not my fault, so... Screw you. Pretty cool looking tunnel here with the sandstone and the half slabs. Apparently that's uh, pretty LOT uh, LOTC inspired, as Candle said. Um, it's pretty awesome. Over here, uh, for all the new members that are going to be coming in within... The new members will probably be here in two weeks, two or three weeks. It depends on how long the application process is going to go through, but this will be your nub town. The nub town. The new nub town. I'm, I'm too excited my words. I'm smooshing them together. I'm trying to save time um, This is the new nub town. So please 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 mongoose country members do not build in this general vicinity Go off in other directions go somewhere else leave this whole area right here For nub town members, you know how like they they like to build way out and everything like that um, This will be your area to work in you have a tiny little farm here inside this place has all of the necessities that you need to, uh, to get going. You have storage, you even have uh, cauldrons and ender chests and stuff. I'm not going to go through the building, but there is beds up top. Um, we'll peer through the window a little bit here. You can see each floor. And there's some beds. There you go. These are for a couple of new people that want to bunk together, you know, keeping it tight. Um, over here, got a mine. The uh, community mine for Nubtown. Pretty epic looking. You got two sections, I have three sections, four, five. You have five sections. You have one really big tunnel right here, and uh, it looks like there's lava <laughs> right here. Ah, let's see, for the lighting. Um, so you have five tunnels that you guys can go and dig down into. He didn't go down there for you because uh, that's your job to, uh, to work your way down there. Anyways, that's going to do it for this Saturday, guys. Um, I was going to do a server Saturday, but... I'm going to give people a little bit more time to, to try to rebuild their stuff on the old map, which will be uh, also hosted on a separate server for, um, for at least a month. We're going to take it down April 6th, I think is the date that I set. And then we'll be dedicated to this, to this map for Season 8. Um, if you guys like this video, I guess? I mean, for those of you who are happy about the new map is up and around, make sure to give it a like. Uh, keep an eye out on my Twitter and Facebook for announcements about applications to join Mongoose Country. And uh, all old members, you guys should be able to, uh, to pop on now. Uh, if not, 
Uh, give it a little bit. DNS takes a little while. Um, Swifty only just now switched it over, so it can take up to 24 hours for the IP to change. Um, but, I mean, I, I logged on just fine, but I think that was because I was on beforehand. So try the old IP. That's play.mongoosecountry.com uh, to log on. And um, if you guys have any questions or something's broken or whatever, please, please, please send me a PM on the forum, tweet me, do whatever that you can to get a hold of me. I'll make sure to come back on and fix it because with every new map, um, especially since we did a fresh install on this map, there's probably going to be a couple of bugs. Um, it's going to take us a day or two to work them all out, but I'm pretty sure we're golden for what we have right now. So I'll see you guys later. Uh, and hopefully next Saturday with a couple of cool builds.